My name is Heather, and I am the major creative force behind the videos that you've been watching on the Pone Lips account, and those are, as I call them, the Josephine Experiment videos, the social satire and an acting experiment. Um, anyways, I have a bit of an announcement for you, and that is that... Oh, <laughs> my dog's barking. I wonder if you can hear that. Anyways, that is that... Um, in the next few weeks, I don't think I'll be making any videos, and I know I probably don't have a hell of a lot of, like, regular viewers, because these video blogs failed at life pretty, pretty spectacularly, but I'm just gonna say I'm not gonna be making any videos in the next couple weeks because, um, two reasons, actually. One of them is my choice, and one of them is a rather unfortunate setback. So the first one is, I've been sort of experimenting, as you could tell from my last video, with some new editing technology, and I apologize for Josephine Speeds Up, that was, I was really bored and I didn't want to do my literature homework, so I did that instead. But I've been experimenting with editing technology, and my editing technology sucks, so don't expect much, but I'm going to see like what I can do, and what I can't do, which is like everything. And also... Um, some of you may have noticed, Josephine Takes Public Transit was removed from the YouTube site. That was not my choice. I didn't choose to remove it. RCA Records filed a complaint against me, a copyright infringement complaint, because I used music in the background that I did not have the rights to. And I'm weighing a couple different possibilities right now because I've considered reworking the video, either redoing it entirely or seeing if I can redo the audio somehow. I don't have as I said before, sophisticated technology, so I can't just remove the music. And uh, I'm a starving actor, so I can't afford new technology. But I've been looking at reworking the video, which will take some time, either that or possibly filing a counter notice against RCA Records saying that I do have, that I'm within the rules of fair use with my use of the music in the background on account of the fact that it's, and I'm not making a profit off of it, and it's not damaging the market value of the music at all, so I'll be up in this huge major legal battle with a record company. Scary thought. Record companies scare me. But that will take some time as well, I assume, because I, I, I just woke up this morning and I'm like, holy crap, I'm in trouble with a record company. Oh, what am I going to do? So that's kind of stressing me out, and it's uh, getting near the end of grad year. So I got a lot of work to do, so I don't think I'll be making any videos in the next couple weeks, but, oh, I do have one thing that I wanted to ask everyone here, which is, I've already had one offer from an up-and-coming band to feature some of their music on an episode of the Josephine Experiment, um, sort of in exchange, like, I'd use the music for free and they would get, like, the advertisement out of it. And I'm wondering if there are anybody out there, anybody who's watching this who's a musician in any way, who would like to have their music featured in a video, um, go ahead and like PM me or something. And I guess some of you out there are like, huh, what's in it for me? But I mean, I'm obviously, it's going to get, you know, the word out there that you have a band. And I'm not going to be like, oh my god, what's this music? It's shit, right? I'm not going to do that. So um, hopefully it would be mildly beneficial to you. And I don't need music, but... I kind of like it. Like, I feel really awkward right now, just sitting here talking without any music, even though, like, nobody's home, because nobody's ever home in my house. But I, I do feel awkward. So, sometimes music is nice. But hopefully this summer I will figure out what I'm doing as far as music, and I will figure out new editing technology, and if I'm not busy all of the 100% of the time, which I won't be because I refuse to have a job, even though everyone in my family is like, get a freaking job, you stupid idiot. Anyways, that has that's a totally relevant tangent that has nothing to do with this. But I'll hopefully be making more videos, and if any of you out there are musicians, just PM me some info, or if you have one of those MySpace music things. Normally I hate MySpace, but I think it's a advantage, advantageous in this situation. So... Anyways, I hope I can figure things out, and just cross your fingers for me that I don't, you know, get sued for a million dollars by RCA. <laughs> Trampled in court. And that's about it for now, because I'm boring you to death. Okay, so. I'm not gonna blow you a kiss. I don't blow people kisses, unless they deserve it.